Hey guys, let's get into this quick weave bob that I decided to do on myself. So I'm gonna use my favorite glue, which is the 30 second glue, and I'm just gonna cut my tracks and place it around on my protectant, and just go around my head as such, and just keep on moving up until you get to the part, until I get to the part where the hair is out at the very top. So after I So after I glue all my tracks in, I like to take my Nairobi mousse and I like to comb my hair down and smooth it out so that it can lay flat without having to put a lot of heat on it. So I mold it down and sit under the dryer for about 10 to 15 minutes so that it can straighten out just fine. And I kind of mold my baby hairs. Then I go in and I cut my bob. I'm like, oop, I hope I didn't cut too much. And after I cut the foundation with my scissors, I go in with my shears, I go in with my razor just to add layers and volume to it um, internally so that it'll move really well. In the front, I didn't do a lot of layering because I definitely wanted to keep the length, but I did kind of do very little in the front just to give it a little bit of movement, but I definitely wanted to keep the length. I went in and did a little makeup on myself as well using um right here i'm using my laura mercier highlighting powder i use my mac foundation today because i'm out of my fancy and then i go in with my favorite blush which is my rare beauty blush it's my absolute favorite um to give myself a little you know a little blushy blush around the face part so i use big sexy hair for my hairspray because it's firm, but it's not too firm. And I go in and curl with my H2 Pro flat irons. And this is the look that he gave. And it was exactly what I was going for. So I was loving it. I brushed it out with this wide brush and this is how the bob came out. Um, I love body and bobs. I love the way it looks classic and seamless. And I just roll this up with my flexi rods at night. And this is a look for the weekend. Oh.